In this video, I will demonstrate the installation and the removal of a TimeCert brand thread repair insert. A TimeCert is a solid, threaded bushing style insert that is used in a variety of thread repair applications. As you can see in this cutaway view, the insert has a very thin walled cross section. The thin wall is made possible because the internal and the external threads of the insert are synchronized or timed with each other. The insert has a flange here on one end that helps to locate it in the housing during installation as I will show in a moment. One of the features of a time cert is that the last few internal threads of the insert are only partially formed. This is designed so that during installation those threads expand to mechanically lock the insert into the housing. To install an insert, use the drill supplied in the kit to drill out the old threads. Then, use this tool to counterbore the hole. If you look closely, you can see that the counterbore tool has this feature that is built into the tool to automatically control the depth of the counterboard surface. Counterbore the hole to the full depth that is possible using the tool, or in other words, until the depth stop feature contacts the surface of the workpiece. The next step is to use the tap supplied in the kit to create new threads in the hole that was just drilled. Note that this is not a standard tap size. This is a screw thread insert tap, also known as an STI tap. An STI tap has the same thread spacing or pitch as the threads that are being repaired, but it has a larger diameter than a standard tap. Use the tap to cut new threads in the hole. There is also an installation tool in the kit. Notice the lobed out of round shape of the threaded portion of the installation tool. That shape helps to expand the partially formed threads of the insert that I described earlier. Here's how to use the installation tool. First, add a few drops of oil to the threaded portion of the tool before using it to help lubricate it as the threads of the insert are expanded. Then, screw an insert onto the installation tool. Notice that it will only thread on part way. This is because of the partially formed threads at the lower end of the insert. And then thread the insert into the housing. The insert should thread in easily until the flange contacts the seat of the counterbore. At that point, the tap handle will become more difficult to turn as the lower threads of the insert are cold formed by the installation tool to expand it into the housing. Continue turning the tap handle until it frees up and becomes easier to turn. At that point the insert threads are fully expanded and the insert is locked into the housing. After removing the tool, the installation of the time cert is complete. Time certs are easy to remove and replace if necessary. To remove an insert, just drive an easy out into it and unthread it from the housing. Thanks for watching. RepairEngineering.com